it's getting crazy with, with everything it is today. That's all you see on the news really is little kids getting hurt. For weeks, families have been feeling the ramifications and demanding change here. Tonight, our Christine Stanwood speaking with loved ones. A 15-year-old Daniela Espinoza shot and killed on Sunday night. A lot of people roll it out. I like to pull it. The sizzling oil is stationed. The fried bread is just a thick bread deep fried. Outside Lena Cipress's home on the corner of 7th Avenue and Broadway Road. I can say you can top it with the green chili, the red chili. The scent of simple ingredients waft next door. I just can't. I mean, I met the little girl a couple of times. To her neighbor's curb. It's now riddled with plastic wrapped roses, red candles, and images of a happier time. When I heard everything on the, right here on the front of my house, I couldn't help but just to break down myself. Lena's neighbor, 15 year old Daniela Espinoza, shot and killed inside her home Sunday. Daniela's brother home from the hospital after also being shot in the foot. For fear of safety, Daniela's stepmom didn't want to speak to us on camera, but says the alleged teenage shooter lived with them on and off for a year. He's now facing murder and aggravated assault charges. Police say he was inside the home with a gun before the shooting. Police say he was, quote, manipulating the gun, which fired shots at Daniela and her brother. Had to do what I can to offer to see what I can do. As Lena fries bread to raise money for her neighbor's funeral. Because I have four kids of my own and I can never imagine that kind of pain. She demands solutions for the continued right statewide teen so, violence. That has to be something to fix it because it's just, it's getting crazy with, with everything it is today. That's all you see on the news really is little kids getting hurt. In South Phoenix, Christine Stanwood, ABC 15, Arizona.